couple years ago. Yeah, we have a, a river in, in uh, western Washington, the Skagit River. We have a lot of uh, eagles on the river at that time in December. Mm -hmm. um, I was out on the river, 24 degrees, wind blowing on a jet sled boat, and a lot of camera gear, and I used my frog dogs uh, suit with layers underneath it, and uh, I was never cold, and I was never wet. So. Why that brand as opposed to the, you know, Gore-Tex Pro is, it's great, it's it's the go-to fabric for outdoors right. people, right. but you you chose something different. I've, I've fallen in love with the Frog Tog um, suit because it's lightweight. Uh, I can move easily in it. Uh, it packs down very well, and uh, it's very affordable for me to take. I can replace my suit a couple of times a year, and, and really well made. Um, enjoy, I enjoy wearing it. Yeah. I feel free and can move for my photography, which I, is a necessity for me. I understand you teach photographers and you teach them not only about points of view and the technical aspects of photography, but also how to get around in the woods or in the right, water or right, whatever. Right. So, so what do you tell young photographers that are wanting to get into the business in terms of apparel and how to be prepared for right. any kind of weather? Right, and, and it's certainly important and you need to um, keep yourself mobile for, for one. And, and, and dry, if you, if you are wet or cold out in the field, uh, it's gonna be very difficult. Your, your hands will get cold on the camera. The cameras are cold anyway. And shaking. And sh you know, <laughs> yeah, so it, it's a difficult <clears throat> thing. So the more you can do to prepare yourself with that uh, and stay warm and dry, and uh, I found the Frog Togs suit to suit me perfectly for that and recommended it to many people yeah. who are wearing it. Excellent. Do you recall any of the, are the particular models within the Frog Tog line that you that you can... Hmm. Uh, um, what, I, what colors do you use? Is it, is it all I, black I, I or use, is it camouflage? I, you or, could. Uh, you, uh, frog Togs, the suits come in, in a variety of colors. Mm -hmm. They're all fairly muted colors. They're not bright uh, yeah. because hunters are using them. Yeah. Uh, uh, so I, but I do use the camouflage. Mm -hmm. Uh, suit myself, but I have other friends that use some of the browns, and, and uh, there's some very well made uh, jackets as well. Uh, shells, shells, outer shells. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, they make jackets as well. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Any advice you'd give to the Frog Tog people in terms of innovation, product innovation? Um, any little tiny thing that you thought, wow, if they could only tweak this or maybe just get more exposure out there in the marketplace so yeah, more people I think could... They, I think they're missing the boat with the photographers. I think they're well-made suits and they have lots of pockets. Uh, I mean, I for for what the product is, it's extremely well-made. The zippers are big and they don't fail. Um, so I, they're doing a great job with the product. Uh, need to see... Uh, more photographers need to know about it. What are your credentials? Now, you're not just an amateur, you're, you're a little more than an amateur photographer. Yeah. You're a world-class photographer, and you have won some awards. What's What, what were some of, what, some of your more recent well, awards? I, I, I've been photographing for probably 15 years. Uh, wildlife is a specialty for me. And uh, uh, this last year, uh, 2016, I happened to be fortunate enough to uh, win the uh, 2016 Audubon Photography Awards Grand Prize winner, which has is, is been an amazing experience, and um, also uh, also some other uh, images that have been well placed in the North American Nature Photography Association's uh, yearly contests and, and in their Expressions magazine. So uh, the uh, the Audubon Grand Prize is now hanging in the Smithsonian Museum of Natural History for a year. So. Wow, that's a big deal. That's a big deal. Thank you. Yeah.